I know Chris Jans, um, and uh, I know his teams play really hard. They're very athletic. Um, they play in an underrated conference. You know, and of course we're in the dreaded 5-12 uh, game. So um, we, uh, we're gonna pack our bags and get on a plane, head back to Auburn. Uh, we get to Auburn, we're gonna roll to Miss Corner. It's been ruled, but we're gonna roll it again. We're gonna celebrate our championship tonight. Uh, coaches will get together and we'll go work on uh, New Mexico State. You know, we have a, a four-team tournament right now. Northeastern Kansas, Auburn, and New Mexico State uh, will play for the opportunity to advance to the Sweet 16. So we'll work on uh, all, all three of our opponents and uh, work on the logistics right now. Where's this team at rest-wise? Do you have to manage minutes, practices, things like that? Well, you know, I wouldn't be surprised if tomorrow we even give them a day off. Um, and um, just get 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 our legs underneath us. Maybe uh, maybe a light lift, maybe some stretching. Um, but I just think it's important that they don't do much. We give us a little bit of time. My guess is we'll try to depart Tuesday morning because we get a, a couple hours going out west. You know, wish we were closer uh, for our fans. You know, uh, Auburn doesn't get turned up very often. They created the pod system to try to keep you a little closer to home, but. You got to be better than a five to be able to enjoy some of that. Um, so uh, we uh, look. We're just we just want to go in there and represent the SEC as its tournament champion. Do you know anything about New Mexico State? Other than Chris Jans, I know their coach. Uh, I know he's a uh, Wichita State sort of disciple. Um, one of his very best friends is a former assistant of mine. So. Uh, um, Sometimes uh, information has a way of passing, um, but that's okay. We all we all we'll all learn a lot about each other, and uh, I just know he's a terrific coach. Um, we got a chance to see them last year um, when we were in San Diego. He, he does a terrific job. His kids play really hard. They've always they've always been very athletic. Considering the way you guys have played the last couple of weeks, did you think you'd be higher than a five seed? Did you think you maybe are a four higher? You know, I don't don't worry about that stuff. Um, uh, you know, to put us on the same line, maybe with Mississippi State. I'm happy for Mississippi State's five. Um, so, just we're just happy to be SEC champions and uh, excited about going to play. Uh, for national championship. I've talked many, many times about the fact that um, you don't have to get to the Final Four to be playing for national championship. We play New Mexico State on Thursday in Utah, and, and that's on the way to trying to win a national championship. So we're playing for it. Your side of the bracket's got a lot of tough teams in it. It's a tough one. Do you kind of tell you guys we need to focus on one step at a time, or do you, do you kind of use that to motivate them? No, we're going to look at the whole thing. We're going to look at uh, all the teams. We're going to look at Carolina and Look at Kansas and look at you know the other teams from that bracket because those are teams that we would have to beat if we're fortunate enough to advance. So you know, we'll certainly focus on the first one. We'll focus on this first weekend. We won't look past that. We'll get ready. It's got three teams. And uh, first thing is let's get back safely. Let's celebrate our championship with our fans. The students uh, are just coming off a break. And all, all weekend long, I kept on thinking about our students on spring break, down in Destin, maybe in the islands somewhere, probably at some establishment or restaurant, celebrating, watching their team. And uh, it'll be exciting to talk to Auburn students when I get back and say, where were you when your team won the SEC championship? I think it'll be a memory that they'll, they'll all have a pretty good story to tell about.